what is up guys so today man in this video bro as you can see from the thumbnail in the title bro this is a serious topic um don't get me wrong pretty boy fredo i'm not trying to bash you bro i'm not gonna gonna sit here and talk trash about you or anything you're a great youtuber you deserve all the love and support in the world you're my favorite youtuber um but this is just something that i have to address i wasn't gonna make a video on this but i felt like there was a need to because some people might not support fredo and they might watch him after this video, but I don't know. Basically, Fredo's a 2K content creator with a daughter, baby Ava, um, and his girlfriend, Jasmine. Um, they um, have two channels, Fredo and Jazz, and Pretty Boy Fredo has his own channel. But basically, him and, as you guys know, DDG, rapper, artist, slash, YouTuber, Dale Granberry, he... Um, he basically 1v1 Fredo in real life for basketball. They wanted to do it for content. Fredo took a trip out to LA and basically said he wanted to create content with DDG. And something went south, bro. Like, the whole video went bad. Um, he played DDG outside. And Fredo said he didn't want to play outside because he's tired. He babies. He watches his daughter. He helps Jasmine. He prepares for the channel. He's a pretty busy person i'm sure a lot of youtubers are busy bro and he said he couldn't be outside he didn't want to he's not really that good at outside because he's gaining a lot more weight and stuff and basically he just doesn't want to be outside because of the heat and he got smoked the first game he got smoked the first game basically he um lost by ddg fair and square he even said it in his video um and then he wanted to take it into a gym and he was frustrated. He felt like he let himself down. And I feel you, bro. Out of anger, he wasn't mad at DDG. He wasn't mad at anyone but himself. So I feel you, bro. I feel you, Fredo. I feel you, bro. But basically, he showed a character that he did not want to show. A side of himself that he didn't want to show on YouTube. Malik is his cameraman. He was basically agreeing with him, obviously. Because he's pretty well Fredo's cameraman. He's not going to get DDG's side. Um, but anyways... DDG and Fredo 1v1 basically Fredo started talking trash to him because he wasn't believing his fouls then they started talking trash um but I'm gonna get into this in detail so pretty boy Fredo wanted to 1v1 him in the gym because there was too much heat outside and he said he doesn't really like outside courts which I can understand some people play better inside but yeah basically wanted 1v1 DDG inside in a real gym um, so he took a flight to LA, played him the first time, gonna play him the second time, and here's what happened, it just went bad. Um, basically, he started playing, he was frustrated, he was mad, DDG literally didn't even follow him, he followed him once, but they were all fair, fair calls, then Fredo kept following him, and basically was calling fouls on ddg but ddg wasn't doing anything like there was no fouls i would literally i wouldn't sit here and lie to you guys um i don't lie to my subscribers so think about this bro honestly think about this bro so ddg kept getting accused for fouls and stuff like that so he kept getting mad because fredo was accusing him and fredo got mad because Fredo wasn't getting the right fouls he was supposed to. And this thing just kind of went down south and just really, really took a toll on Fredo's basically YouTube career. Um, DDG made a video on it at the end of Pretty Boy Fredo, um, which isn't true because I'm sure his fans will stick with him because I still will. But they might lose a little respect for him, but they'll still stay with him because he literally apologized for about five minutes straight. On his video saying that's not him. He didn't want to show himself as that. Represent himself as that. Because of his daughter. And mainly because of his YouTube um, subscribers. So that's understandable. He said he did that out of anger. He was basically mad at himself. Because he lost the last first game. And he wanted to take it back out on the court. And he wanted to try and you know. Try his hardest. Play his hardest. But he kind of took that to another level. And played way 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 too competitive. And over the limit. And basically kept following DDG and then DDG would say that isn't a foul and he'd basically say that is blah 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 they talk trash to each other then so on and so forth Fredo made an apology video um, um, basically he apologized before the video started and then he got into the footage DDG made a whole video on pretty boy Fredo basically saying that this is why he doesn't um, 
you know, compete as hard as possible in basketball because people take it too serious and they go over the limit and over the board with the kind of competitive ways in basketball. But um, yeah, I, I don't blame DDG. Fredo also said that he doesn't really com compete and, um, you know, do a lot of um, collab videos with other YouTube content creators because things can go down south. They sure can, bro. Trust me, I've had a lot of videos I've wanted to do with YouTube content creators and they just never show or they never w are willing to do it because I'm lower um, subscribers than them or something like that. They think that I don't post good videos. My videos are too short. But I'm going through a lot. Um, I'm really going through so much, dude. I'm going through a lot right now. My grandma's having problems with her heart. So, yeah, I'll make another video on that. Um... So, yeah, it's just a lot, but I'm not going to put all my personal info out. I have more stuff that I'm going through, but I'm not going to put that out because that's dumb. But anyways, man, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Hope, hopefully it wasn't too short. Um, let me know if you guys did enjoy these, these types of videos, these news videos. And, uh, yeah, let me know if you guys want me to do more videos like this in the future. So, uh, yeah, it's been Neat Gaming, and I'm out. Peace.